The consumption of cannabis for its intoxicating effects is thought to date back thousands of years in Eastern cultures. Marijuana can be consumed in many different ways. In this video, we will be looking at the difference between smoking and edibles. Users that smoke marijuana place it into a cigarette containing tobacco. This is known as a joint or smoke it through a bong or use a hollowed out cigar called a blunt. When smoking the psychoactive compound, THC is converted to Delta 9 THC, which binds to the cannabinoid receptors in the brain, causing constant stimulation of neurons, quite like a pinball machine. During smoking, THC is rapidly absorbed from the lungs into the blood circulation. From there, it crosses the blood-brain barrier. Smoking gives a faster high because of this, however, has a shorter duration when compared with edibles. When making edibles, aka space cakes, THC is dissolved into fats such as butter due to its lipophilic properties. The THC is once again converted to Delta 9 THC due to the heat applied when cooking. Achieving the high when taking edibles usually takes much longer, from anywhere between 30 minutes to 2 hours. This is because the drug is absorbed by the gut and then processed by the liver. In the liver, the Delta 9 THC is converted to 11-OH THC. This chemical is highly potent and has a higher affinity for the cannabinoid receptors in the brain, therefore giving a stronger and longer high when consuming edibles. There are many other factors that affect a person's high, such as the strain of cannabis use, the quantity and the person's history, such as mental health and previous drug experiences. However, it is often a lot harder to predict how high you will get when on edibles due to the change in potency of the THC chemical. Luckily enough, marijuana is not toxic, so there won't be any long-term side effects or chances of an overdose, just the potential of going on a bad trip if you're not careful. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe.